Earlier today, I had a friend ask me, Austin, how do you define and find a purpose? How do you continue to pursue that path? So in this video, I want to give you a few guidelines and an analogy for finding your purpose and following it that I think a lot of people miss out on. And if you haven't already, make sure to press the subscribe button so you get notified when videos just like this come out in the future. Your purpose is not something that is rigid and set in stone. A lot of people do pick a purpose. I'm going to be a basketball player and I wanna be in the NBA and I'm gonna be the best ever. But what ends up happening is they leave the NBA and they don't know what to do because their purpose was already fulfilled. Maybe they die, who knows? That is actually what we see time after time with people who retire, who give up work, who play golf for a little bit, hang out with friends sometimes, and eventually just coast into death. And not that death is a bad thing, but the fact that they don't have a purpose in North Star defining thing anymore is what is pulling them to just end everything. And so we can't think about our purpose, our path, our mission, our calling as one thing. It never is because in reality, we are here to experience and experience itself is not a purpose, but our purpose changes based on the experiences that we want to have. So an analogy that I like to use is when you're bowling and you have bumpers, essentially you're never going to, unless you're an amazing bowler. So if you're an amazing bowler, I, I don't want to offend you, but most people don't roll it straight every time. They sometimes bank it off the sides, which then gets them the strike or whatever they're trying to achieve. And so these bumper pins or training wheels on a bike is what allows us to continue to shift and find our purpose. Oh, we think this is our purpose. Our purpose is to help people. And we start to veer that way and then we go, mm, I don't really think so. I think my purpose is actually to be the best version of myself and to make sure that everybody's better off for having met me. Okay, I'm going to veer more towards that. Oh no, I think my purpose is to eradicate all of the toxins in the ocean. And it can be specific or it can be very broad in what your purpose is. Your purpose is more of the guiding North Star of your values, of who you are, of how you do things. So I think living a life based in understanding that your purpose evolves and you never have to be set to constricted, confined means when you say, this is my purpose, this is who I am, and I have to act that way forever, but instead, actively figuring out more and more about who you are, what you like, what you want to do, what your purpose really is, and incorporating that into your life. It's not about becoming some rigid person who won't allow intellectual honesty to play into who they are. And intellectual honesty is the fact that when new information or knowledge comes into play, do you shift your beliefs, behaviors, and the information that you think you know more towards what the truer truth has been exposed to be now? A lot of us don't do that. We don't keep uh, intellectual flexibility. And you see that with influencers or people who clearly have had science disprove what they're talking about, but because they built their platform on X or Y, they stay that way forever. We're humans, we're flexible. I change, I constantly change, this channel will constantly change. And the reason is because I'm constantly finding who I am, what I am, and what I'm trying to do. So if you take one message from this about how to define and find your purpose, it's that write something down because you have to start now, but realize that over time you will evolve because everything in life evolves. And just through evolving, your purpose will become more and more defined and more and more aligned with who you are at your current state and time. So if you're comfortable, share your purpose below. Otherwise, make sure to press that subscribe button so you get notified when videos just like this come out in the future.